Good morning students. In the professional ethics lecture series for the unit 4, the topic that we are going to discuss is about risk benefit analysis. So, which is prepared by a Slokish very assistant professor in from the city department in RM Regional College. Let's we move on to the session. So, we basically going to discuss about what is meant by safety and the risk. Basically, we are going to discuss about to concentrate only on the risk benefit analysis and the assessment of the safety and the risk and how to reduce the risk and then we can study the case studies also. So, first that we should know what is meant by a safety and what is and the risk. A thing is safe if its risk are judged and it should be the risk are acceptable. So, common understandings of safety are underestimate the risk, overestimate the risk, no judgment on whether the risk is acceptable. Safety is a matter of how people would find risks are acceptable or unacceptable if they knew the risk and then and awful maker categories are experimental risk connected with the introduction of new technology risk associated with the new or expanded applications of familiar technology risk arising from the misapplied attempts at the disaster control what is meant by an acceptability of the risk which should, which should not harm to the humans and the risk is very acceptable that so things are said to be acceptability of the risk. A risk, risk is acceptable when those affected are generally no longer apprehensive about it. Apprehensiveness depends upon how the risk is perceived. So the elements of risk perception is showing the volume, sex of the knowledge, job related pressures or potential victims elements of risk perception so first one is volunteerism and control volunteer risk people take up the risk of only knowing the hazards in the motor racing like they should they know the risk but they are doing it intentionally so in order to prove something so in the level of control display an unrealistic confidences when they believe an hazards due to under their control symbols is motor and these are two the best examples in hazard sports under the assumed level of control. What are the elements of risk perception? Here they have taken some example. So as a case study, two groups of 150 people were about two strategies available by for combating a device. So here it group one here you can see that group one is using some description and group is following something. Okay. So it's not relevant to this topic actually, it's not required. Job related risk. So exposure to the risk on a job is a sense of voluntary. Often employees have a little choice other than to stick with it for them. Engineers who design and equip the workstation must take into an account an attitude towards the safety known as by the co-workers. Magnitude and proximity of a reaction to risk is affected by the threat of the possible mishap. In terms of magnitude and proximity, friends being affected more dangerous. Assessment of the risk this is very very important. We should whenever we are build, we are working in a company as a quality assurance officer, we should concentrate on what about the risk, what is the what is the safety of this company, what are the risk factors which are involved in the company, and then whether it is an acceptable manner or not. Improvement of the safety is accomplished by an increase in cost, primary cost that is production cost, secondary cost that is warrant expense, loss of customers goodwill. High safety, high risk and low safety. High cost, low primary cost and So this gap is last so how risk is taken. What is the so we have different testing for determined So this is scenario on access testing the scale. So we have the 